morning! Right, we're going to start this episode off with a couple of 10Ks and uh, there might be a 5K there in the mix as well. Slack off, slack off. I'm not sure where we are, we can't 60. Right, I wondered how many candies we had for that. It's only strong, still yet to get a decent one, but we'll keep the candies for that and get this one hatched. Snorlax, nice. We've had a that's really that's the second one we've had in a while. Our last one was 1907. This one isn't as good, isn't as good. No, never mind. And that 5k has got just a few steps to go. Right, we'll get that sorted. Then. The news, not just in, is shiny Cubone and shiny Ponyta have been released. And there's a few things for me to shiny check here. Because I'm going to put a lucky egg on, actually. Why not? And a star piece. Let's get this show on the road. Because, ah, do you see those x-ray passes then? Oh, oh, it's going, it's going. It's going. We are in Riversley Park now. Diglett. Never mind. We don't mind, because we've got other stuff to do. Oh, one of the cubos has gone. Shiny check. Oh, oh. This AR mode gets on my nerves. Well, this one isn't a shiny, but we'll catch it anyway. I want to see if I can get a first ball excellent catch if I can. It's been a while since I threw it at a bone to be honest. It's probably a bad idea. I should have gone for the ponytail. That's a lot easier to get an excellent throw on. <coughs> there we go anyway. Sorry about that. Uh, got him. Two day streak. 55 candies we're up to now. Well, make that 56. We've got the Marowax we need. We'll shiny check this. Now, the shiny pony turtle I think looks amazing. That blue flame. Watch me get an excellent throw first time. I never let you down. Unless I do let you down. If I do let you down, I didn't mean it. But this time, I did not let you down. And uh, there you go. Easy beans. Let me have a look at our task situation. Evolve two PG temp water types right. Let's spin this, see what this gives us. Catch five Pokemon with weather boost. No, didn't mean to press that again. I want to shiny check this. No, it's not. So yes, the reason why they've released these two shinies is I I don't understand the connection, but I have read the connection actually, I do understand it. I, I'd sound like an idiot if I said I didn't understand it. But basically, shiny Cubone's green, shiny Ponyta is, has the blue flame, and the two teams in Ingress, which is the Niantic's main, I say main game, Pokemon's probably took over now, um, they are blue and green, the two teams that you can choose. So, uh, yeah, um, they're celebrating something within the game of Ingress and want us to celebrate with them. And I'm up for that, as you've seen on my screen before. I've got the ingress up there. Uh, I do try and play it. I don't really know what I'm doing. But I've got a few mates that do play it quite well, I must say. And I've tried. I really have, but I just can't get near around it. So, tell you what we will do to get today's stamp is we'll evolve a couple of pidges. I've got two here. Plenty of candies to evolve. Them. I should try and save them really and get some more pidges and more tasks. Uh, get some more Pidgey tasks to do, but I just can't wait, you know, I've just got no patience. So we'll get these two evolved. I've already IV checked them. Both going to go in the blender. And it only counts on evolving Pidgeys this time, not the Pidgeots. Pidgeottos, sorry. As well, the previous task, you could evolve the Pidgeotto and it counted. Right, now this is done. We'll get our stamp for the day. We've done our two day streaks. Um, there is a two star raid at Melly. I haven't checked to see what it is yet. Sneasel. We've already got a 98 IV one of those. Ah, this ain't shiny. So I'm not going to pressure myself to go and get it. But I will pin up bury this. Only a great throw. I, w I will not lie, I was trying to get the excellent, didn't get it. Right, I've got a few hours to kill because my car's in the garage getting fixed in the mechanics lot. Fat tyre, all this and that wrong with it, so I've got time to burn today. 
Good job I'm off work. A one star hatches at 20 minutes past three at the jailhouse, which is hopefully going to be a shinx. I'd take a snow, snow runt as well. I'd take a snow runt, I would. So fingers crossed that's going to be one of those. In the meantime, I've got 25 minutes to go and hunt as many of the uh, possible shiny utilities as I can. I'm going to walk around this corner first and see what's there. Make five curveball throws in a row. Well, that's easy. As long as they stay still. No Pokemon here at these two stops, so that's that surprised me. It really has. I'm going to head into town a bit more anyway. So if something interesting pops up, I'll definitely go get it. Definitely, without a shadow of a doubt. I might do this Sneasel raid actually. Shall I? Okay, biting the bullet. I'm going to do it. Got our pass. We'll spin the stop. I'll enter the lobby. It's a raid. A raid's a raid, and I like raiding so. Let's just get raid done. Not taking that squad in there, no way Pedro. So basically, this is a squad I'm taking in. Fire and fairy. Nothing wrong with that. They should make a fire fairy type Pokemon actually. <sighs> so, maybe taking fairy type in was a bad idea. We'll see, but we're super effective so far. It's only a two star raid. So I think I'll do all right. But the thing is, kind of a grudge using a pass on this gym. Now it's not X-Raid eligible, which is so heartbreaking. It's always nice to have in three gyms right next to each other, mind. Where you could, you know, get X-Raid passes. Whoa! They seem to know Beat the horn, dude. Let me know you're coming. Lord above. Look, tiny little path there. Nearly killed me. And then in bed with Borough Council, you ought to be ashamed. Right, let's take in uh, our God of War. Oh no, it's got ghost type moves. That was probably a bad idea. Yeah, no, take them out. Why did I think Fairy was a good idea? This has got psychic moves. Oh no, another bad idea then. Oh, Arcanine, I choose you. Here we go, that's better. Oh, right. Fire blast. Oh, I should have took my Charizard in actually. Didn't think about that. With blast burn. Which, by the way, as predicted, if you evolve your uh, Quillava to Typhlosion on Community Day, next Saturday, well, this Saturday coming actually, um, you're going to get, bla it's going to get blast burn. So, um, if you've got a good Cyndaquil, hold on, don't evolve it yet, wait until community day and then evolve it. We've got a rare candy. Right, 12 balls at this. We've already got a 98% one, so for me this is just extra candies. Candies I didn't really need to invest a pass in because we get a lot of sneeze all around here, where I'm from. And that was down in one ball, never mind. I was hoping I could get that five, ex five uh, nice curveball throw quest or whatever it was done within this uh, task. And this is a maze HP attack. No, it's not as good as the one we've got, but it's candies. Oh, there's a shiny check. Magikarp is still nesting here at Riversley Park, but it feels as if, honestly, it's a Cubone and Magikarp nest mixed with a bit of Ponyta. Do you know, I was just about to walk away from this, but one, two, three, that's quite big for a magic art. Magic art, 123 CP, down, done, deadly, transferred. Not good enough. Totally not good enough. Can we uh, spin the stop in this gym again yet, or what? Yes, we can. Will we get another pass? No. Why do I feel as if I'm not getting enough passes out of this game? Okay then, the next bit of news is, if I go to my items, why did I feel like that was going to glitch? Right, I got an x-ray pass for the bandstand, 
November the 15th at 3.30 p.m. I have invited my good friend Matthew Lilly here and in return he has invited me to another x-raid on the same day a couple of hours before and I've invited him to uh, he's invited me sorry I invited him to the bandstand one so on the 15th of December I'm unaware of what I'll be doing but the 15th of November I will be doing two x-raids in the same day not going to get to the lucky egg done because one's at one one's at half three but I'll be there I'll be there for both so expect an x-ray uh, extravaganza video coming from that last thing last piece of news really that I want to tell you about um, is celebrating Gress Prime's launch with t-shirt avatar items at no cost so I am going to change my shirt to the team that I do support on Ingress which is stay tuned and you'll find out but first this piece of news the world of Ingress which influenced the experience that trainers enjoy in Pokemon Go is changing right before our eyes see details below so that's when it starts down time features three new Ingress themed t-shirt avatar items are now available at no cost in the style shop if you're lucky you may encounter a shiny pony tart or shiny cubone so if we go all the way into style into tops it's probably chart time we changed our celebrity shirt now this is a standard ingress one this is the uh, the green team i forget what their names are i'm sorry guys if you like ingress but yes that's right i chose the blue team so i'm gonna put this on probably shouldn't really as i'm valor um hang on a sec no, so, no, I'm going neutral. I'm going neutral. I'm sitting on the fence here. Sitting on the fence. That's the shirt I'll be wearing. Uh, yeah, that's that's what my style is going to be looking like. Oh, I've done 7.6k already this week. I think it, the the uh, kilometer thing goes from Monday to Sunday because uh, I seem to have had two batches of stuff in one go. And I tell you what, being a bus driver with when I, obviously when I'm driving a bus, my phone is away right but it still picks up the kilometers so i'm nailing 50 kilometers a week probably very easily so that's kind of a, a bit of a i don't feel proud about that niantic you need to help me out here because i don't feel proud about that i know i could easily just switch it off but i'm not going to say no to free stuff now am i right i'm going into the town i want to find more q bones and pony tas so we're uh, now I've bored you with all that news, we've probably had a good 10 minutes chatting. Let's go and get down and dirty with the game. Well, as I uh, just sit down to do a bit of editing, um, I didn't carry on uh, recording today because, you know, things just happen. So, um, but I did get to do a raid. I recorded the screen as I was doing the raid because I got a chance to just do a quick uh, shinx. Um, I'll show you that right now. I'll just get the footage up. Um, I was battling this with using me Reggie Rock, gave it a charge move, didn't finish the shinx off, using a charge move, which surprised me. I thought Stone Edge might do the trick, but no. But then, as you can see, shinx goes down with his dramatical dramatics we get one golden raz a rare candy one potion 750 star does some xp 14 balls and uh this will make you laugh look at look at the monstrosity that i look at that poor effort then i throw a ball to the side and then i throw a ball and he heads it away i'm sure no i hit him no i thought he was going to head it away then but he didn't so uh yeah we got that wasn't very good wasn't shiny but nonetheless it's candies and that put us to 63 candies so we're well on our way also whilst i was doing that i pogo plussed a shiny ponyta you can see it there we appraise it it's not all that great but look at that how majestic it looks that blue flame looks just amazing I wish it was bigger in CP because its IVs ain't very good. So I'm probably not going to max it out. But 
if I don't get a better one, I will evolve this. So yeah, we got shiny ponytail. And uh, the way things are uh, looking at the moment are... We are 700,000 away from levelling up to 39. I'm going to do what I can um, throughout the, the week, I suppose, to... Come on, what are you doing? This has been so glitchy lately, it's really getting annoying. Yes, there we go. 700k, I'm going to do what I can uh, to carry on throughout the week and get closer. Hopefully... Hopefully by the weekend I can level up because then it would be nice if I can make it to level 40 before the new year. Let's try and set a deadline for Christmas shall we? Christmas, new year, let's try and level up them. That way then, I mean I started this account on February the 7th but I didn't really start playing on it until March because I was too scared to turn the camera on him front of my face. Oh, I only need one dragon type to get gold on that. I wonder if... Right, okay. Okay, we're going to... There's the shiny Jatine. 21 candies. No, that's such a... I have got... 49! That's awesome. Right, let's just evolve this. Because I really do like uh, shiny dragon air. Right, we'll evolve this, and that will give us the gold badge, I'm sure. So, yeah, let's end let's end the episode off this way. That, that's that's a good way to end the episode off. This makes me so happy. Shiny dragon air, another majestic looking Pokemon. Look at that, like the Queen of Sheba. Well, hopefully now that's put us on the uh, 200 mark for uh, our dragon medal. Yes, I was thinking then that didn't count. There we go, catch 200 dragon type Pokemon. Let's, uh, let me just make a screenshot of that. Cool. Cool beans. Right, I've got a couple of Swinubs here, I'll probably catch those. But um, yeah, we we're going to leave the episode here now. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, give it a like. If you dig what I do, subscribe to the channel. And uh, apart from it being a good morning, good night.